Hello, I am Jay and welcome to my first geography video. So, in the background you see a picture of South America. Um, and you see something different. I didn't exactly wait for you um, to come so that I could write it then. I wrote it before you came. So, I just got that advice and I wanted to try it and yeah. So this is part one of South America. It's called Countries and Capitals of South America and I will give you a fact for each of the countries. And don't forget to watch part two. So let's start with Paraguay. Paraguay is a landlocked country and it is one of the only two, it and Bolivia, are the only two in South America that are landlocked. Landlocked means like it's not, it doesn't touch the ocean. So like Brazil, as you can see, it touches the Atlantic Ocean, so it's not landlocked. But Bolivia doesn't touch any ocean, or Paraguay doesn't touch any ocean, so it's landlocked. Then let's move on to Uruguay. Uruguay has the wor world's lo lo longest national anthem. Oh, and Paraguay's capital is Asuncion. And Uruguay has the world's mo longest national anthem and its capital is Montevideo. Then we go south into Argentina. With Argentina's capital is Buenos Aires and it is the and it is the country that is second closest to um, Antarctica. Now I'm going to, I'm not going to show you the first closest but you can see on the map here if you you might be able to see the whole thing but okay you can pause it if you want but I'm going to move along um Next, we're going to go up north, and we're going to go down the Pacific. So, Colombia is the only is the only um, country in South America that borders an, another con another country that is not in South America. It borders Panama in North America. Then we move along the coast to Ecuador. Part of Ecuador is the Galapagos Islands. The Galapagos are somewhere over here, where you see the blue edge. And the Galapagos is the only thing that is bef that the only uh, place in on the world where above this line right here that I'm making with my hand that is home to penguins we go down the south we go down south to peru which is oh and quickly um colombia's capital is bogota and ecuador's capital is quito quito um then we go to peru which is capital is lima it is home to Machu Picchu, one of the world's most ancient cities, up in the Andes Mountains, which starts around here and goes down to here. Then we have Chile. Its capital is Santiago, and it is the first closest, um, or closest, to a country in the world to Antarctica. Now we are going to go to um, up here to Venezuela, Guyana, and Suriname are the three countries I'm going to do next. So Venezuela, its capital is Caracas, and it is and it has a lot of oil reserves. Guyana and Suriname. Guyana's capital is. Georgetown, it is spelled G-U-Y-A-N-A, -A, and Suriname, and Suriname's capital is Paramaribo, 
and these two countries when you're writing down all of the countries in South America or when you're, when you're drawing a map of South America like I did they're sometimes forgotten so yeah they are two countries in S South America now we're going to go to Brazil um, we, Brazil's capital is Brasilia Brazil, Brasilia kind of easy to remember and then Brazil is home to Pelé the Great. He is the world's best soccer player, um, world best known soccer player. And then um, he is 79 years old. And so you may have noticed that I've saved two countries for last. Bolivia, which somehow has two capitals for some reason, and French Guiana. And why does it say region of France here? We're going to find out. So, Bolivia does have two capitals, La Paz and Sucre, and somewhere around over here between the two capitals is a frozen salt lake. And it is really big. And French Guiana is not exactly a country, but I, uh, but I included in this video, it is actually a territory of France. So, and French Guiana doesn't exactly have a capital. So those are all of South America's countries and capitals in part one. Be sure to watch part two and so i have a new addition to my videos let us welcome um fun fact of the video today's fun fact is um south america has 13 countries out of which two are landlocked and it is the and it is the closest to Antarctica and almost and almost all of it lies beneath the equator which actually one country in South America is actually named after the equator its name is Ecuador so so now we have question time today's question is um if you if you know a fun fact about so this one actually isn't really a question but if you know um, a fun fact about South America or anything else you can leave it down in the comments below and if you like this video or any of my other videos be sure to like subscribe and hit the notification bell bye